Hey, what's going on guys? So I'm about to go running with my wife, but I wanted to tell you guys about um, this story that I saw by a guy named, about a guy named Chris Marzalek. Chris Marzalek is the CEO of Crypto.com. And you've seen that just like FTX, Crypto.com uh, is a big crypto company that has uh, entire arenas named after it and all kinds of crazy stuff. Well, basically according to CNBC, Marzalek could be the next Sam Bankman Freed. Um, they're laying out this article basically saying that he's been responsible for a lot of failed startups, um, which isn't a crime, by the way, uh, but also that there were some shady business dealings in these startups where he was accused by a judge of stripping the company of cash, uh, not paying creditors, uh, you know, kind of doing some things that led people to believe that he was not reliable, that he was not... Um, trustworthy you know there um that was one of the uh, terms the judge used if i'm not mistaken they, they said he was an unreliable witness and uh and this is interesting because on one hand marzalek is saying that this is nothing more than fud fear uncertainty and doubt being cast on crypto.com and a lot of people are defensive of that for good reason at the same time uh you know with ftx um you know just like crypto.com there was uh you know st there were statements by sam bankman fried saying that the company's assets are safe and everything's good and don't worry next thing you know the company's bankrupt and so crypto.com is kind of going through the same thing right now and i don't know how this is going to end this could be very very interesting because trust is a big deal in the crypto space right now right now uh the uh the fear of crypto is very very high i think i saw a study that said only eight percent of americans believe crypto is a reliable asset sam bankman fried just ruined it for everybody i mean it, you know what happened with ftx was ridiculous and uh it's really making people say i'm only going to invest in this industry if they redo it if the regulators come in and fix everything so um i'll keep you guys posted on it i'll do some more commentary on it a little bit later but this whole story with marzalek it's on cnbc and some other places you'll find it pretty interesting and uh my advice not my advice my perspective uh on this is um, I don't believe you should put all your money on one exchange and you definitely should put all your money in crypto, not even more than t seven, eight percent of your assets in crypto. Uh, and if you do put it in crypto, I wouldn't put it in on the same ex all on one exchange or maybe take it off the exchanges altogether. They have cold storage and stuff like that. So anyway, guys, I'm out of here. Hit the thumbs up button. I'll see you soon. Take care. Have a good day. Peace.